once again, I'm just going to change my pad real quick. <clears throat> I'm going to take my pad, which has been numbered 14 for 14,000. I'm going to put my pad on here. This is a brand new pad, so it's, you know, we're going to have to season it once again like the rest of them. I'm going to dampen the surface, dampen my pad. I'm going to wipe the surface off again. We really want to make sure that you remove the grits from the previous polishing, polishing uh, steps so that we're getting the full effect of the next step. Dampen the surface. I'm going to agitate my 14 a little bit just to make sure the compounds are blended. And I'm going to add a little bit there to it. And once again it's the same procedure rub it around, blend the water and the compound to generate a paste. And once again we're going to start at a low speed and then we'll work ourselves back up to a higher speed for this application. It's getting tacky now so I'm going to go ahead and switch it on. So you want to hang on to the head of your machine. We're really achieving the wet look now. becoming so polished that when I put water on it, it beads up and actually rolls off.
Well, that concludes the 14,000 grit. And uh, I have to say, I believe it's sharper than the original factory finish. But let's clean it up and check it out. As you can see, we have brought this stone back on this side with the Polishing Pro systems. As a demonstration piece, you can see the scratch is still across the center. The haze line from where we were working the stone to get it to the point where we could polish the system and the factory finish. You too will be able to accomplish this following simple steps.